Hey everybody, Santa back again with another update. <laughs> it's getting more ridiculous. Still uh, Friday, July 5th here. And uh, the guys just left. They took all the uh, garbage and the um, extra materials. They loaded up the truck and they headed out because I think they want to make it before the uh, road closes. Of course it might even be open maybe uh, because it was too muddy they weren't working anyway so they uh, they looked and looked and looked again they measured <laughs> then he got on the phone with uh, Don Don this um, guy Dave who apparently is a co-owner co I don't know he came with uh, another guy that came with JP a long time ago when they first did the work, uh, I forgot his name. But anyway, Dave is the one we talk to most of the time. Dave's the one who called Don Don. So apparently they got on the phone, they discussed it. And uh, he came back, told us, oh, Don Don said just for the uh, damages, uh, we counted the number of tiles that were damaged. So to fix those and labor would be 15000 I said, what? H how do you come up with that? Oh, to, to pick out the damaged ones and replace those. I said, how are you going to do that? How are you going to do that? you got to figure out the replacement value of the entire house. I said, you can't just pick out the damaged ones. Those towels aren't available anymore. And... Uh, if you break one out, if you break one, probably the one next to it's going to break. I said, we're not doing that anyway. We're not going to uh, retile. I said, you got to figure out a price to uh, replace all the tile. Figure out how many square meters materials and labor it would take to retile the whole place. I said, you're crazy, 15000 I don't know where you get that from. And I said, don't forget the basketball court also. You guys are not figuring right. You cannot figure to pick how many tiles are damaged. I don't know how you're figuring this. So I got Grace in there too. She said the same thing. She said, that's a ridiculous price. There's no way. Uh, so then I told them, if you guys don't make us a reasonable offer on how to replace every tile, whether we do it or not, whether we choose to do it or not, you have to figure out a price to replace all the tile, labor and tile included. If you don't figure out a reasonable price, uh, I'm going to get an attorney and I'm going to uh, start a lawsuit. I don't care how long it takes because um, your, your figure is completely ridiculous $300 not even you think you can fix all the tile you can't just pick out the pieces that are destroyed you have to do the whole place so he said okay well I'll tell Don Don everything you said I'm going back to the office now and we'll tell him and we'll come back. Uh, we'll get a hold of you sometime next week and see again what he says. I said, okay, well, you better do this quick. I said, in the meantime, can we move back into our house? He said, yeah, you can. Uh, we've already documented all the damage. I said, so have I. It's all on YouTube, everything. I said, in the meantime, I will call also, I will call my friend uh, Jocelyn who signed the contract and is friends with Don Don's mother. I'm, I'm going to let her know everything that happened here. But she watches my videos anyway, so she knows what's going on. But your, uh, your offer is ridiculous. So, that's what's happening. Uh, other than that, the guys here, they're cleaning up all the trees. They're doing all the trees. Oh, there goes a big branch now. And everything that's falling, they're cleaning it up. Michelle's helping. They're doing a good job. And then we just have to pay them a little bit just for cleaning. 
but uh, the rest of the money comes out of the coconut money whenever we get paid for the coconuts to buco. Okay, so right now the kids are eating a little lunch, then they're going to take a nap, and then uh, then we'll eat after that. But we got to take care of them first. And then tomorrow, we're going to start moving back into the house. And also, Grace is going to go in town. She's going to give the police uh, the uh, brang eyed letter from Jimmy Boy. And also, she might, uh, <laughs> coconut rolling this way, she might also, uh, if the mayor's there, talk to the mayor about this erosion, if he's in his office. So she's got a couple things she needs to do tomorrow. And uh, I'll start moving furniture back in the house. That's the plan. So once again, stay tuned. Just another ridiculous, pretty much, pretty much waste. I definitely didn't expect that 15,000 low ball offer. <laughs> All right, like and subscribe, it's free. God bless everyone, Santa Claus, over and out.